Merry Christmas! <laughs>a lovely Christmas or if you don't celebrate just a lovely day we're in a completely different new setting today it is a very grey and gross day so I needed the room with the most lights so we've got this office vibe with Winnie the Pooh chilling with me this is my little like sack thing like you know people get like a stocking this is mine it's good little presents yes I am the age of 20 and I still have a Winnie the Pooh sack but that's how we go so we're making the scenes christmasy today he's just gonna be chilling in the corner with me oh today we're gonna be filming a what i got for christmas i love watching these um and giving a disclaimer i'm not bragging don't want to offend anyone with like ha, this is what i got um i just love watching these videos i love being nosy and seeing what people get for christmas so i thought i'd do my own rendition and also i think it's just a nice thing to like look back on just to see what i got so yeah first i'm going to start with this gorgeous little cardi that my nan knitted for me so um this is cute little number she's a bit longer but i've like tucked it up just for now it's got a cute little collar and then the back is like this basically i was talking to her about the um house of sunny cardigans so like the daybreaker cardigan and all of them that they're gorgeous cardies a gorgeous little scene on them with a collar and i was like wow i love that with the collar and she was like i literally have an ink pattern like that and i was like <laughs> i want it so that week it kind of all fell into place that week at aldi it was either like craft week or like sewing or like haberdashery week or whatever and they had some wool and they had this gorgeous like oatmeal color with this green and me and my mom were like these are the colors that we want because i wanted it that I could wear it all year round. And I feel like this is a good colour choice. So I'm extremely happy with this. Fits me so nicely. I think it's so cute. And oh my god. The best little touch. Basically I'll put in a picture. They The little buttons say handmade with love. <laughs> so cute. So cute. Um, honestly so happy and so grateful for this. Like this. I think this. I'm going to keep like I appreciate it so much more than if I went on to the House of Sydney website and just bought that cardi but <laughs> speaking about House of Sydney oh, okay this was like my main Christmas present ah, I got it oh I got the dress Kendall Jenner eat your heart out base okay this is the House of Sydney hook me dress in honey oh she is stunning I'll insert some pictures of me wearing it. But gorgeous cutouts in the back. It's just a gorgeous, gorgeous dress. Like, I knew it'd be good quality. But when it arrived, like, it is so soft. I think it's beautiful. Just take that in. Take it all in. Stunning. Here's a hint. If you haven't bought anything from House of Sunny, um, you can sign up to their newsletter and you get 10% off. So this was... Is it bad to talk about prices? No, no, I'm actually going to talk about them. This was 98, but then you get the 10% off, so it was like 89 pounds. If you can hear those dogs, I'm really sorry. I don't know if you're going to be able to. If you can't, so I'll just ignore them. Um, this is like my first like designer piece that I have ever owned and this is definitely gonna be another piece that I'm gonna be keeping for years like this you can style it obviously in summer stunning little like little trainers or chunky trainers or equally I think I'm gonna be wearing this with like my docks um cute maybe like a tilt on a conceit you can either wear it like a jumper on top and have it as a skirt so versatile so stunning so beautiful very happy with that now we have a talk about knitting that's another knitted item we've got more knitting my mom knitted me this hat <laughs> so cute obviously not gonna look great i've got a clip in my hair so not gonna look great but look how sweet this was another little aldi special she said she um i think she bought some wool and on like the packet it said how to knit a hat so She's knitted me a hat, my brother and my sister one as well. So we've all got little matching hats, which is super cute. Um, and I love a good hat at the minute. 
bringing me some an extra item. Another fluffy bucket hat. Now this is gorgeous. I think this, obviously, not not like this, but I think it's gorgeous, gorgeous sage colour. Very on trend right now. Um, it is massive to be fair on my head. Like I've got a normal size head, but it's still quite big. But gorgeous. I just think fluffy bucket hats like this. You can wear such a boring outfit. Put this on. Stylish Pinterest queen. Very happy with that. My uni house is freezing. Um, and I always complain about it. So my sister got me these massive socks. This is more like a stocking. They're literally fur lined with the fleeciest, softest material ever. And they're nice and long. And they've got those nice things on the bottom, like the rubber bits so you're not going to be slipping around the shop gorgeous and we so warm picture me wearing these with the hat maybe this hat as well the dress and this over the top knitted warm queen thank you this was such a nice little surprise my friend lily well okay basically a few days ago i got this little package in the post and obviously it was addressed to me and it's on the back of it don't open till christmas and i was like i haven't i would thought like i haven't ordered anything so it's not that and i looked at the writing and i was like i'm sure that's lily's writing so the cheeky little minx got me some little harry styles earrings if you don't know me um i am in love obsessed infatuated destined <laughs> joking to be with harry styles i would do anything for that man i really would so <laughs> to just have him with me all the time we have these gorgeous little fine line harry styles earrings which are gorgeous and i think actually that might be a sticker because if it is a sticker it's going on my phone case <gasps> it's a sticker <clears throat> very cute very cute oh my god and i believe these are handmade i would presume so oh wow they were the wrong way so they're even more colorful oh my goodness how stunning how beautiful craftsmanship so you can make something like that wow I'm gonna be wearing these imagine that knitted outfit these popped on as well next we have a diary i am very much a person who likes to have a diary and i mean as in like a um like plan my life kind of diary kind of ting basically i'm very very specific about my would you call this planner no a diary you know a week on two pages diary i'm very very picky about my planners because like my life isn't that interesting and exciting that i need a day a page Equally, I like to be able to write things. Basically, all I write in these is like, um, like what uh, uni sessions I have that day. If there's any like, um, like talks or anything, because uni hosts like a lot of different talks from like people from the industry. So I like to just drop them in, so I know kind of know what I'm doing. Um, but this one's from Paper Chase from my sister. They have loads in Paper Chase like this. Um, I found like a few cute designs because actually Paper Chase were one of the only few places that I could find that had a panel like this. Paper Chase got me in clutch. Wonderful hardback. Will be, yes, I will mysteriously walk around campus like this. I got my banana. Next, I want to be more sustainable with my like things that I use in my everyday life. So, one thing that kind of irks me is. The amount of waste that I produce simply when I take my makeup off. Like, makeup wipes are so bad for the environment. And to be fair, most of the time I use my cellar water and, like, cotton pads. But to be fair, I don't actually know. I would imagine they're not great for the environment. But my auntie got me these organic bamboo cotton reusable pads. So they're literally just the same as cotton wool ones. So you just put your micellar water or whatever cleanser you want. Oh! Basically, you just put your micellar water on there and just take your makeup off and bang this in the wash as you're doing the rest of your clothes. And it comes in a nice little string bag. Really, really nice. So that was from my auntie. Love that one. And then also on the sustainable journey, 
she got me a metal straw but this isn't just any metal straw sorry i'm trying to show this it's a little metal straw that you can like attach to your keys so it's like portable you see this it's a metal straw i can literally take this round with me you can literally be like oh a drink great you have your straw how incredible and it comes in it as well um a brush cleaner let me get that out comes with a cleaner as well so i could be sat in the pub thinking oh i really fancy a gin but damn don't want to drink it really quick so my paper straw is going to go mushy no worries i have my metal straw and when we leave oh hold on let me just do a quick clean wow a really great purchase that you can just pop it back in your case when you're done she's back in there pop the cleaner back in there and why won't that shut now <laughs> oh it wasn't down enough there you go very impressed with that very happy with that then we have a classic a lush classic who does not love some lush products for christmas my brother got me these and gas for this because i don't have baths that often but when i do they're a sensational experience so in here i'm not sure oh they smell so delicious how christmasy and luckily in my uni house i have a bath and i feel like that's a very lucky thing for a student house and like it's a nice bath it's not like falling apart um there's loads of these are these the ones that if you put them in water they dissolve it doesn't actually say what's in here angel delight butter bear candy cane snow fairy snow fairy that's the one that everyone loves isn't it oh my god is it a shower gel of snow fairy or whatever it is a shower gel i've never had the shower gel of it oh oh that smells like banana and shrimps little foam things this was made by john thanks john i'm gonna be smelling so sweet so fresh so tasty and then we have classic to finish it terry's chocolate orange if you don't like these get away from me <laughs> no incredible this was my dinner last night after a fat christmas lunch i then had this for tea with some pizza and blankets it's all about balance ladies and gents but yeah that is everything i got and i'm so happy with everything that i've got i'm gonna be looking like a knitted goddess <laughs> humble yourself um but yeah, I'm extremely happy, extremely grateful for everything that I've got. I hope everyone had a gorgeous day. Um, I know obviously it's been very different this year, but I hope nevertheless you still had a lovely day. Um, please let me know what kind of videos you want to see from me. We're like four videos in and I'm already getting creative block. <laughs> I hope to see you in my next video. Thank you everyone who subscribed. Thank you everyone if you're simply just clicked on this video and you're watching me. I hope you don't find me too annoying. And me and Winnie the Pooh will go eat some more chocolate and live it up. <laughs> <laughs> I'll see you all in my next video and I hope you have a lovely day. Goodbye.